Okay, tools needed for this job will be a small flathead screwdriver and possibly something like a dental pick and a large uh, and a large flathead screwdriver or something similar in size and scope to possibly pry with. Okay, today we're going to remove a broken locking gas cap for Harley Davidson. And if you have one of these locking gas caps where you need a key to open it and uh, for example on this one you put in the key uh, and try to turn it uh, it doesn't seem to catch the locking mechanism and it won't, doesn't seem to want to uh, turn out so uh, we're going to try to remove this so you don't have a stuck gas cap okay so what we're going to do, we're just going to take a small thin screwdriver and what we're going to do is we're just going to try to get in under the lock and see if we can just pop this out. Okay, and this is the cover that just popped off. It's the cover that covers the uh, keyhole. Keeps uh, from debris and stuff getting in there. So I just happened to come out. So it's part of the process. So we'll keep it on the side. Okay, we're going to try to get a little screwdriver in here. See if we can pop out a lock. Trying to work gently from side to side. Now it may damage you a little bit, obviously if it's not working, you don't have much choice. So cover came off. We're still just gonna try to work it up here. There's a little spring that holds the latch, the uh, keyhole cover too. I'm just going to set this aside. And again, not much of you can do if you it looks damaged because obviously you're probably not able to get in anyway. So just got to do what you got to do. Okay, so now we pop the lock out. Okay, here's the lock. Whether it can be saved or repaired or not, I don't know. I'm not going to try at this moment because I'm just going to replace it with a different gas cap. But uh, if you wanted to try to repair it, you'd probably have to look at that. Now I can see right here that this piece here on the bottom looks like it's uh, cracked and, and broken. Uh, I think this should be flat, but as you can see right here, it is bent up so that was probably uh, that was probably why it was not working and it wasn't uh, turning or engaging the uh, ratchet when you turn the key so now that we got it out okay now that we got the lock out I don't know if you can see this but there's a little catch mechanism here right here and we're just going to try to move that and see if we can spin at the same time we can uh, turn uh, we'll, we'll try to push this with a screwdriver and then we'll try to turn the uh, gas cap and see if that will uh, allow us to uh, turn it out and that, uh, that a gas cap will come off Okay, so now I'm just going to push that ratchet here with my screwdriver. See if I can get that to engage here.
Okay, so what I'm going to do is the screwdriver didn't work. Um, wasn't able to get the catch. It looks like it's kind of loose in there. So I'm going to try to use a, a hook or a dental pick and see if I can put in a slot where the uh, ratchet catches and uh, see if we can uh, do it that way. A little hard to see. It's a little hard to get the, find where the slot is with this dental pick. I might have to rotate it around and kind of play with that dental pick to kind of feel where it kind of just clicks in. There, now I got it. I got it clicked. Now let's see if we can get it started here. All right, so as you can see, uh, trying to uh, use the screwdriver dental pick to grab, uh, find the slot with the uh, ratchet catch mechanism uh, just didn't work. So I'm going to try to maybe put a little leverage on. I'll put a little, little cloth here. Try not to uh, scratch any of the paint, so I'm just going to take a big screwdriver here and then maybe if I can get some leverage maybe we'll get it to catch oops well something broke <laughs> oh, well that's alright whatever it took took a little pry bar to kind of pop something out so that's what we ended up doing but at least Got it out, because otherwise it, w it didn't come out before, so you're just stuck with uh, a locked gas tank, and it's and if it, this was on the right side of the tank, so it'd be hard to keep your gas tank full uh, because uh, the petcock on this one's on the left side, so uh, if you'd only fill it up on the uh, left side uh, with the left side gas cap, you know, you, you can only put in so much, but uh, with the right side open you can fill up the whole tank so unfortunately it looks like we pretty much destroyed the lock and it doesn't appear to be any uh, way to repair this but it is what it is at least uh, we were able to uh, get it out and now I'll just replace it with a non-locking gas cap and we'll be ready to go thanks for watching